as I noticed, there's no shoes on here because the guy I got it from, which happens to be his neighbor, he liked floating. I'm like, that's fine, but I prefer shoes, which is your depth sitter basically. So I'm gonna install them. I have them. I got them from Amazon.com to be exact. Alrighty. See here. Alrighty, let's go unwrap this. Five on there. Okay. No problem. bottom of the blade the edge I should say this right here Get this out of the Well, let's try something here. It's a little stuck, man. I can put it down, push up. No. All right. On the bottom, I put 20 washers, and on the top, four. That's one. All right. Let's get some of his Justice Brothers penetration oil here. It's almost out, but I had this quite a while. You see, I had this for a while, 15 years. Good to have in your truck box. Uh, let's see the pin. All right. All right. That's it. Oh, wow. <sighs> this is tricky. I'm sure it's because it's rusty, but so. 
All right. Earlier I went without any blocks to see how it goes and as you see here it seems like the blocks work out pretty good. If you see here my dad had to weld a couple plates. He did pretty good. It was just rust holes there. I mean his plow is old. I don't know how old. At least 15 years. Well. For a plow can't go wrong you know. Well there I'm set for the winter. It's a learning experience, a little bit of trial and error. The guy I bought it from, named Mike, he said, eh, you'll get used to it. Thank you for watching. We'll see you on the next one. So long.